today lecture i am going to discuss about how to create folder in csop.net or we can say how we can check if the folder is exit or not so let's see the codes so first here writing a string then after a string so object or variable initializing with some path okay so let's give here at the rate and inside the double code we need to paste the path okay so let's uh, copy this location and paste there so here uh, we can identify uh, there is no any folder on the desktop with the name of asus so giving here asus okay after that the next is here using if condition so if condition then after here io so we need to use here not equal to then directory directory so here when i press the directory then automatically there is the namespace that added system.io and uh, the next is press start then exit and uh, here str so uh, when that exit okay so here when that exit then uh, directory dot create directory str then after let's write here console dot write line then i'm going to print the message inside the double quote folder created else or uh, this not created so this is the code here so here this is the location that i passed on the desktop then if not directory exit so if the directory is not exit then that or uh, condition is true then that coincide this will create the directory okay at this location str or uh, this value is now so this will create the uh, directory or at this location and uh, when that created then that uh, print the message folder is created okay so now you can see there is no any or uh, directory on this uh, desktops so here i'm going to run this code directory or folder is not in the desktop so folder is created because this part is doesn't exit now you can see on the somewhere let's refresh so what exactly is the part okay files inside the here inside the files that you can see also so folder or directory that's created now i'm going to change the into the desktops so desktops so here let's uh, uh, folder is created also folder that's uh, created here okay so this is the four lines of code to create the directory so first uh, here str you need to pass the path after that you need to check so if already exit so it will not create if not exit then will directory dot create directory that will create suppose so uh, uh, here also already is there then i'm going to i'm trying to create once again of this uh, folder so here you can see the blank space that means so uh, it's already is there and if i take the conditions so it's uh, already is there not directory exits so directory already exits so this condition is here or uh, false so this will go at this place out of the if statement and this is waiting for to input some or uh, input or uh, anything from the keyword okay or uh, here you need to give a meaningful message console dot right line folder already there okay so now if i uh, run this calls 
So now you can see folder already is there. That's the uh, displaying. Or you can put this into as a part. Because uh, if I give an, if I delete this or source from the desktops and uh, try to run one next once again, then then you can keep get here two masses folder is created and already is there. So for best uh, practice, let's uh, put this on the as part and uh, no need to give uh, anything else and uh, here lo now let's uh, delete this folder and uh, creating so you can get here folder is created and uh, folder created and if i try to run so folder already is already is there so if i try to run once again so this uh, already is there so this as part go and this is a printing or this message folder already is there so this is how we can check if the folder already exists or not by using the csr.net so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you